If you've ever admired the graphical style of the Borderlands video game series, this video is for you. My name is Robert Paseka and in today's video I'm gonna show you how to get these characteristic outlines inside of Blender. The easiest but not most efficient way is using Fernell node. So I'll start by giving basic material to our Susan. For the sake of simplicity I'm gonna use just a simple diffuse shader. You can choose whatever color you like, I leave it at default. Then I'm gonna duplicate our diffuse node and set the color to black. This will represent our outline. Then I'm gonna add a Fernell node and set the IOR somewhere near below 1. You can preview it by clicking on it while holding Ctrl plus Shift button. To be able to do that, you have to turn on the Node Wrangler add-on inside of User Preferences. Somewhere around 0.98 should do the thing. Then I'm gonna add a color ramp to crank up the contrast of our mask and make it look more flat. Then I'm gonna plug the output of the color ramp now as a factor in our mix shader. This is a custom compositing note made by user Color Emblem on a BlenderArtist.org. I'll leave a link in the video description. I'll start by giving each Susan different object pass number in the object tab in a properties window. Then I'll go to Render Layers window and under Passes enable Object Index option. I'll also enable the noising option for cleaner render. And I'm gonna render the image. No I'll also set up a different color for each Susan. But I'm still using just a diffuse shader. Now I'm switching into compositing preset. I'll enable backdrop and use notes no option. Now I'm appending custom freestyle node from a file that I downloaded. A link is in the video description. Then I'm gonna add an ID mask node. You can adjust the line with the sliders as you like. Surprisingly, a lot of people believe that this function is supported just by Blender internal render engine, but that's not true. This feature was actually added in Blender 2.72 update. Freestyle rendering is a pretty complex topic, so I'm gonna simplify. I'll start with enabling freestyle option in render tab inside the properties window.
This slider controls the thickness of your outline. We leave these settings at default. Now I'm hitting F12 to render the image. I hope you liked this video, and if you found it useful, give it a thumbs up so more people can see it. Thank you for watching, bye!